Hello YouTubers. This video is a small demo on how to normalize and scale analog output value. Please do not forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Let's get started. In Siemens world standard value range of analog signal is within 0 and 27648. So for example if you have a proportional valve, that is controlled by signal 4 to 20 milliamps, then digital to analog converter operates within range of 0 to 27,648, where 27,648 applies to 20 milliamps. Set points between 0 and 27,648 will be linear scaled within range of 4 and 20 milliamps. If you want to open valve by 50%, you need to set a set point of 13,824 and so on. Those values aren't very meaningful for the operator, or the engineer, as you need to do a math every time you want to change the set point. To avoid that, instructions norm X and scale X comes in handy. These instructions can be found in the folder named conversion operations under the basic instructions. To scale value within range of 0 to 27,648, instruction scale X is used. You need to set a lower limit as 0, upper limit as 27,648 and instruction gives you the result. Everything looks good, but there is one catch, input value range of instruction scale X is within 0 and 1. It means that expression is within 0 to 1 and result is within 0 and 27,648. Here comes instruction norm X. It maps your value to linear scale within value range between 0 and 1 of the data type of floating point. Let's go to the programming part. Drag and drop instruction norm X from library to the network. This example will be based on the forming of the analog signal of 4 to 20 milliamps, with the possibility to change the limits dynamically. Assign floating point tags to the inputs min and max. At the input named value, assign your set point tag. Instruction will generate result, which value will be within 0 and 1. Now we need to scale the norm X result to the range of 0 to 27,648. Drag and drop scale X instruction to your network. Assign 0 to input min and 27,648 to input max. Assign result of the norm X instruction to the input named value. The result of this instruction will be value within 0 to 27,648. All is done, let's try our program. By default my norm X limits are 4 to 20. As you can see, the value of analog output is 0 while set point is 4. Let's make it 20. Now the value of the analog output is 27,648. All the other set points are within scale of 0 to 27,648. Let's try to change the limits to something like 0 to 20. The value of the analog output has changed instantly. And again, analog output values are within 0 to 27,648, but now low limit is 0, and high limit is 20. In my previous video, I have talked about analog input. Link to it you can find in the description. 
I will combine both projects. My analog input is within range of 0 to 10 volts, and output is within range of 4 to 20 milliamps. Let's try to change the value at the analog input. As you can see, the value of the analog output changes according to the value of the analog input. I will try to change the limits of the analog input to the range of 0 to 5 volts. As you can see, the readings of the analog input varies between 0 and 5, while analog output set points varies between 4 and 20 milliamps. That is that what I wanted to show you today. If this video was useful, please do not forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and happy coding.